Okay, we're going to be setting up SpyBot Search and Destroy today. Very good program. Here's the EXE. Double left click. Okay, first we'll start with language. Uh, English, I try to speak English. Not many people understand me, but I try. Hit OK. And accept the license agreement. Next. Uh, here we can use uh, additional languages, skins, whatever you, whatever you need here. It's fine for your for your needs. Um, skins good. Change skins appearance. You get tired of the look. You can change them. Next. Next. Uh, desktop icon. That's what I generally just use. If you use a quick launch, by all means, put a check in that. Whatever you need here. Um, hit next. Install. Spyware is a very big business today. Um, it's not really that harmful for your computer, but it does slow you up. If you're using um, multiple browsers and you're on a chat program, and it just just seems to, you know, make the computer run a little sluggish. So it's a good idea to keep it all off. Okay, finish. Okay, here you have uh, the choice to run uh, Adaware along with the SpyBot Search and Destroy. Uh, not necessary, um, and uh, you can make a backup of um, things that were fixed. Uh, I, I typically like to run separate programs. Um, you know, do a SpyBot and Search and Destroy for your spyware. Adaware, you get Adaware. Um, I think that's a good idea. Keep keep the program separate. Okay, here um, create a registry backup. Not necessary. Um, search for updates. I'm going to show you manually how to set the updates, and this is immunization. I'm going to show you how to set that up. Rather, you know how to do that because you're not going to see this window every time. Okay, once it's set up. Okay, start using the program. Okay, here we're going to go for updates first. Okay, search for updates okay you're gonna put a check in everything except T timer English T timer help we're gonna not check uh, what that does is it could be very annoying it'll look to run um, at certain points and it can be it can slow you up and be annoying and look for things and wants to run in the background and just avoid that so you're gonna avoid tea timer okay now we're gonna download download uh, updates okay a uh, DOS window will appear that's normal it's just loading everything into the registry okay okay hit OK now we're going to immunize. You left click immunize here. Okay, very important to immunize. It's going to update all the newest threats that are out there. Very important. People miss that point. Um, I, it, the, the program is totally useless if you don't have all the threats updated. Okay, so, and then you hit immunize again. And you really need to do this every time you use the program. Very important. Updates, <coughs> excuse me, updates and to immunize it every time you run the program. Okay, now we're going to search and destroy uh, problems. Here, we're going to hit check for problems. Okay, this will run anywhere from 15 minutes to four, five, six hours, depending how much stuff is on your computer, how much it has to scan, how big your hard drive is. And uh, when it is done, you'll see another little box will appear in this area, and it's going to say Fix Problems. So you fix the problems, and it'll tell you what was fixed, and that's it. That's basically it, and you're done. I hope this video was helpful to you, and I'll see you the next time I make my new video. Have a good day. Enjoy your computer.